Hey. Hello, worms. I'm the word worm, and I love digging for letters. I've been in the ground all day, and I really want to learn some new words. It's more fun when you learn together, though. So, do you want to learn with me? I knew you would. Let's see what letters we can find today. Watch this. Look what I found. It's an A. A, A, A. What words begin with A? A is for ant. Hello, ant. A is for anchor. Whoa! Phew! A is for arrow. A is for apple. Mmm, that looks tasty. Hmm. Ooh. Hmm. I found a ba. Ba is for butterfly. Look, it's a beautiful butterfly. Hmm. Ba is for biscuit. Ba is for banana. B is for bat. Hello, bat. I'm off to find another letter. Oh, hey. oh. <laughs> Look, it's a K. A curly K. K is for crab. K is for cat. Look, it's not just any cat though. It's the orange cat. Did you know that you can spot this orange cat in all of our videos? Look out for him. K is for cake. K is for candle. Oh, I'm a bit tired now. What have we learnt today? We've learned a, b, k, ant, anchor, arrow, and apple. Butterfly, biscuit, banana, and bat. Crab, cat, cake and candle. Thanks very much for learning with me. Let's go digging for letters together again soon. Hello again, worms. It's me, your old friend the word worm. I'm feeling very excited today. Do you know why? because we're going to go digging for letters together. It really is my favourite thing to do because I love finding new words. Last time we were together, we found a, b, k. Let's see what's next. Get ready to go underground. Here we go. Yeah! Here's a da. Da, da, da. Da is for duck. Quack, quack, ducky. Da is for dragon. Da is for dress. Woo!
Look at me! <laughs> what comes after duh? It's an eh. Eh, eh, eh. Eh is for egg. Oh dear, he broke the egg. Eh is for elephant. Whoa, he's a big elephant. Lovely trunk you have there, Mr. Elephant. What's that sound? It's very noisy. Oh look, it's an engine. Eh for engine. Cars have engines inside them and that's what makes them go. Look, I found a f. F, f, f. f is for frog. Ribbit, ribbit, Mr. Froggy. Hop along now. F is for flower. What a pretty flower. F is for fork. Here we go again. It's a G. What begins with G? Grass. Lovely green grass. That begins with a G. Here comes a goat. That begins with G too. Oh look, Mr. Goat has eaten the grass for his dinner. G is for goat. G is for gate. Shall we look together at what we have learned today? We have learned D, E, F, G, duck, dragon, dress, egg, elephant, engine, frog, flower, fork, grass, goat, gate. I've really loved learning with you today. You've done very, very well. I'm hungry after all that learning. I'm off to take Mrs. Worm and the maggots to Wormtown. See you next time, worms. Hello, worms. I've missed you. Oh, hello, Mrs. Worm. Hello, Wormy. I've been looking everywhere for you. Sorry, dear. I was up here talking to the worms. Say hello to the worms. Hello, worms. Lovely to meet you. Are you digging for more letters today? Yes. Perhaps you could help us, Mrs. Worm. I'd love to help for a little bit. But then I'll have to go and pick up the maggots from school. OK, then. Here we go. Look what I found, Mrs. Worm. It's a ha. Ha, ha, ha. Here's a hedgehog. Ha is for hedgehog. He's quite cute, really. Make sure he doesn't eat you, Mrs. Worm. Ha huh is for hat. Does it suit me, Wormy? It sure does, Mrs. Worm. Ha huh is for hammock. Ooh, I might just have a little rest. Don't be so lazy. You've got work to do. Go and dig for another letter. I'm going to pick the maggots up from school. Bye bye, worms. See you again soon. Bye, Mrs. Worm. Better go and dig for another letter then. <laughs> it's an eh. Eh, eh, eh. Shall we see what begins with an eh? 
insect. What was that? Look, it's an iguana. The iguana ate the poor little insect. Here's an igloo. Igloos are made from ice and people live in them. I'm going to burrow down for another letter. It's a J. Ha ha! Look at that! It's some wobbly jelly. Have you ever had jelly at a birthday party? I love it! Can you guess what I am doing? I'm jumping. That begins with J. Ja. Jump. Oh, that's pretty. It's a jewel. Hop. We found a kicking K. What begins with a kicking K? Here's another jumping animal. It's a kangaroo. Hello, kangaroo. Kettle. Kettle begins with a kicking K. Oh, it's got windy. Here's a kite. Have you flown a kite before? Are you coming for dinner, Wormy? Yes, dear. We're just going to look at what we've learned and I'll be there. Today we've learned H, I, J, K. Hedgehog, hat, hammock, insect, iguana, igloo, jelly, jewel, jump, kangaroo, kettle, kite. Thanks for watching, worms. I better go and have my dinner. I hope it's jelly. <laughs> See you soon. Bye. <coughs> Welcome back, my little letter-digging worms. It's so good to see you again. I've been very, very busy digging for new letters and now I need some help with the words. Do you think you can help me? Wow, you're keen today. Well, in that case, I'm going, going, going underground. Woo! Look what I found. It's a la. La, la, la. La is for Ladybird. Hello, Mrs. Ladybird. How are you today? La is for Light Bulb. Bing! I have an idea. La is for Lollipop. I bet you love lollipops. So do I. Yum, yummy. It's the letter M. M, M, M. Can you think of some words that begin with M? Oh, M is for monkey. Hello, Mr. Monkey. M is for Mars, a planet in our solar system. I wonder if there's any worms on Mars. M is for mask. Oh, do you think it suits me? <laughs> hmm. Now, what comes after m? <laughs> That's right. N. 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 N is for noodles. Noodles look a bit like worms. But don't ever get them mixed up. 
Worms are not for eating. Na is for necklace. Oh, Mrs. Worm would love that. Wait, where's it gone? Na is for nest, which is where a bird lives and lays its eggs. I'm getting awfully tired, but let's go digging for one more letter. Down we go again. I found an O. Oh. O, oh, O, oh, O. Oh. O oh is for orange. Lovely, juicy and round. But what colour is it? Oh yes, silly me. Of course, it's orange. O oh is also for oven. This is where you cook your food, but you shouldn't touch an oven because it could be hot. Oh my word, you're a big bird. You must be an ostrich. That begins with O. Oh. Phew! Shall we look back at all the words we've learnt today? We have learned la, ma, na, o. Oh. Ladybird, light bulb, lollipop, monkey, Mars, mask, noodles, necklace, nest, orange, oven, and ostrich. Whew, what a real mix of words. I've really enjoyed searching for letters with you today. Will you come back again soon to help me? I'm off to have some dinner with Mrs. Worm and the maggots. See you again soon, and keep your eyes open for new letters. Hey! Hello again, my little worm friends. I'm looking after the baby worms today, because Mrs. Worm has had to go to Worm City to work. They're snug and cosy underground at the moment. But if you see any of them poke their heads out of the soil, will you shout and tell me, please? Right. Let's get to work and dig for some letters. Eee! Here's a P. P, P, P. P is for pumpkin. Oh, we love carving pumpkins at Halloween. Whoa, what's that noise? Whoa! Ooh, P is for Plane. Oink, oink. It's a pig. Hello, piggy. P is for pig. What? There's a baby worm behind me. Where? I can't see her. Right. Let's look for another letter then. Here's a qu. Qu, qu, qu. Qu is for queen. This is the queen of Wormland. Queen Wormet the Fourth. Your Majesty. Qu is for quilt. This will keep me warm at night. Qua is for question mark. More babies? Where? Are you tricking me? I can't see my babies anywhere. I'm going back underground to look for another letter. <coughs> it's a r. R, r, r. R is for rabbit. We both live underground, don't we, Mr. Rabbit? R is for ring. Ooh, what a pretty diamond ring that is. R is for rocket. I've always wanted to fly in a rocket. Hup. 
I found a sa inside here. Sa, sa, sa. Sa is for star. Wow, that was amazing. I was the first worm in space. Sa is also for snake. Sa is for spoon. That's what you use to eat your breakfast cereal. Oh, there you are, worms. Have you been popping up behind me this whole time? Are you hungry? Let's just have a quick look at some of the words we've learnt today. We've learnt P, Q, R, S. Pumpkin, plain, pig. Queen, quilt, question mark. Rabbit, ring, rocket. Star, snake, spoon. Right, come on kiddies, it's time we went downstairs for some dinner. See you next time, bye! Hello again my letter digging friends. I'm excited to start the day because I have a lot to show you all. I've been doing a lot more digging for letters and I've made some excellent finds that I can't wait to show you all today. Let's begin. Here we go. It's a ta. Ta, ta, ta. Ooh, what's this? Looks like a teddy bear. Ta is for teddy bear. Isn't it cute? Oh no. Ta is for tiger. And it's mistaken the bear for one of its cubs. What's next, I wonder? Ah. Here's an ah. Ah, ah, ah. It seems to be raining. Good job I have this umbrella to keep me dry. Ah is for umbrella. Oh no, my umbrella has been blown up, up, up into the sky. Uh is for up, which is the direction my umbrella has gone. Let's have a dig around and see what's next, shall we? This is a v, 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 v. What's that noise? There's a violin playing. What a sound. V is for violin. But oh, what's that? There's a vulture. V is for vulture. And I think it must have enjoyed that tune. Hip. Here we have a w. W, w, w. Wow! Would you look at that? He is huge! This is a whale and he's the biggest animal on planet Earth. Much, much bigger than me, for example. What is for whale? That's right! What is for worm, which is exactly what I am. A wa 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 worm. Here we have an X. X, X, X. Ooh, 
what's this? That man is having an X-ray. X is for X-ray. It lets doctors look at all of your bones to see how to make you better. I don't have bones like all of you back at home. Here's a ya. Ya, ya, ya. Wow, who is this big hairy creature? It's a yak. Ya is for yak. And what do we have here? A yo-yo. Ya is for yo-yo. My little worms at home have one of these. They aren't very good because they don't have hands. How about I go and grab our last letter? Hup. Here we have a Z. Z, Z, Z. Look, it's another animal. A zebra. Z is for zebra. It's a good thing that the tiger isn't around. Oh, look, a zipper. Z is for zipper. Most of you will have seen these on your coats that you wear when it's raining or cold. Wow! That's the last letter of the alphabet. That means we've looked at 26 letters. That's a lot, isn't it? Shall we take a look at what we've learned today? Today we've learned T A V W X Y and Z Teddy bear Tiger Umbrella Up Violin Vulture Whale Worm X-ray Yak Yo-yo Zebra and Zipper well, I've had a cracking time finding new words with you today. You've done a very good job. We've all had so much fun learning words from the entire alphabet together. And you're welcome to come back and visit us any time. Ah! Remember, there's always new words to find and learn, no matter how big you are. So keep searching, worms. Bye!